Labor Day gift this morning. We are giving makeovers to three very special people, volunteers and good Samaritans. We felt deserved a little pampering. You'll meet them in just a second, but first, celebrity hairstylist Brian Renfro. Hello. Welcome, Brian. Nice to see you. And we have Gilbert Solis, the celebrity makeup artist here, who took care of all of these lovely ladies. First off, I want to bring you to Stephanie. Stephanie is standing here with us, and we'll take a look at her before shot for just a moment. Stephanie has helped so many people. She's cared for the families of the disabled. She's cared for loved ones. And she is here with us now in her new look. And I want to begin with you, Brian. What did we do with Stephanie's beautiful new look? It well, looks fantastic. Well, first of all, what you can't see is the picture because her hair was pulled up, is that her hair was about halfway down your back, right? Stephanie yeah. and so we got rid of that and she she showed me some pictures she wanted it sort of PC layered at the bottom not too short on the top so I did that and just blew it dry with a big round brush and it'll be easy for her to keep and I think she looks so beautiful she looks fabulous how do you feel I feel good <laughs> you look great thank you Gilbert tell us about the makeup very soft yeah well Stephanie has gorgeous deep brown eyes so I played those up kept everything else really really sheer um, I used a forest green around the eyes to make them a little bit more sultry and they use a really soft pink on her lip. Stephanie, how does it feel to be pampered in light of the fact that so much of your life is spent taking care of others? Well, it feels really, really good, and I honestly have never done that before. <laughs> so, Well, we're so it's happy great. you could join us and do it here with The Early Show because you look fantastic, and thank, thank you for all you. that you do for communities. All right. All right, thank you so much. Let's bring out the next individual, Tori is coming out. She is a 15-year-old beauty. She is a little sister in the Big Brothers Big Sisters organization. And Tori, here's your new look for the viewer to see. Looks fantastic. Thank you. Love the eyeshadow, by the way. Gilbert, tell us about the green eyeshadow. Well, uh, what I wanted to do is really capture the youthfulness, so I added a hint of green. Uh, we did a classic liner in black, a little bit of mascara. I used Sephora's tinted moisturizer to keep her complexion really sheer. Mm -hmm. And again, a really soft, neutral lip. Looks fabulous. I also love the hair, Brian. Thank you. Really was... big. But well, really it was, fun big. It was long, and the problem with it being so long is that she has a beautifully shaped oval face, but the hair was so long it was dragging it down and making it look like a skinny little narrow face, so she needed width and volume, and she's got natural curl <laughs> that it wasn't cut to utilize that natural curl, so I chopped into it so that the curl could come out, and then just used a huge curling iron and added a little texture to it, and this is what it's... She could, she could just blow this dry with her fingers. It looks so simple and easy to do. So how do you feel about it, Tori? Oh, it's really nice. I like it. I like the new look. It looks fabulous Thank on you. you. You wear it well. So you're a little sister in the Big Brothers Big Sisters organization. Is it something you'd like to do to grow up and be the big brother, big sister in the program? Yeah, I think it's really nice. A nice mentoring program for you know kids my age to go out and have fun. Well, I hope you're having fun here today, too. Yeah. All right, great. Well, okay. it's great to see you, and uh, thanks so much, guys. You did a fabulous job with Tori. Tori, we will see you in a few minutes, but we want to bring out our next guest, Erica, who is coming out. Your son, Erica, has been ill. You have spent a lot of time caring for him, yes. and you are here with us today. Yes. For your makeover, you look fantastic. Thank you. Love the entire look. Thank you so much. Brian? She had just, she's been growing her hair out, so was in a construction phase. I didn't want to cut it all off because mm -hmm. personally, I think it looks great long. It's but beautiful. it was very heavy, so I went into it and I layered it a whole lot. And then I just put Velcro rollers in it and combed it out with my fingers, so it should be easy for her to maintain. And she still has long hair. A makeover is not always to do such a dramatic change that they don't know who they are. Such a good point. Gilbert, the makeup looks beautiful. Yeah, I loved working with Erica. Um, what I did with her is I made her look like herself, but better. And I did that by enhancing her features playing up her eyes, adding some definition, and look at her smile. I mean, it's gorgeous with the touch, it really of, is. touch of a neutral lipstick and lip gloss, and voila. Erica, do you get much chance to spoil yourself ever? How does it feel to be spoiled for a day? Well, uh, it's wonderful. As a mom of three, it's never easy to take care of yourself or have time, so I'm really very thankful for this opportunity. It's been great. We are so thankful for you being here you. with us, and so many thanks Thank to you, you. Thank Bryant you. and Gilbert, as well. Thank you, everyone.